Hello everyone and happy Giving Day. I just wanted to take a quick second to tell you a little more about what I do here at the museum as a Boley Scholar. And so one of the projects I'm actually working on this semester is developing a QR code quiz for our exhibits. Now we used to have a kiosk which visitors could use to take these quizzes, but with COVID they're very high touch areas and we were concerned about that. So we wanted to create a quiz that you could actually take on your own device. Now what I did to create this was I chose objects from the exhibits, I wrote questions about those objects, and then I used an online quiz generator to put those questions online. I then generated QR codes to take you to those quizzes, and so it works like this. You take your phone and you scan the QR code with your camera app. You then, this little banner will pop up. You click the banner, and once it loads, it'll take you to the quiz right on your phone. And so you can click start. And now this specific question has to do with the bas relief that depicts Monroe's involvement in the signing of the Louisiana Purchase Treaty. And if you get the question wrong, no worries, there are multiple attempts. But the correct answer to the question is the Louisiana Purchase Treaty. So when you click that, you get a green check mark. A little fun fact to kind of elaborate a little more on the question. And then it'll pop up and tell you you've completed the question and gives you the chance to put a stamp in your passport. Now these passports will be a little card that families can use to track their progress through the quiz by putting a stamp in the box for the question they've just completed. And what I'll do now is I'll take you upstairs and show you what it might look like once these QR codes are actually installed in our exhibits. So here we are in the actual exhibit. And now the QR codes with this exhibit are not the ones that are going to go with the quiz. This is actually a new exhibit that was just installed by our curator, Jared. And he used QR codes to be able to talk a little more about the objects themselves. So this might look a little bit similar when we install the QR codes for the quiz. You'll be able to scan it with your phone. You'll see the objects right near the QR code so you'll know exactly what you should be answering the question about. And it'll give you an opportunity to interact a little more with the objects. So that was just a little sample of what I've been able to do here as an intern at the James Monroe Museum this year. And if you would like to help other students have the chance to have these experiences, please consider donating. The link to the Giving Day page will be included in the description of this video. Thank you so much.